Today on ReviewTube, we're going to take a look at one of the kings of gaming in YouTube, especially in the world of retro gaming. Today's episode, let's focus on Metal Jesus Rocks. MJR uploaded his first video onto YouTube on April 15, 2006 titled, Happy Birthday William from Metal Jesus Rocks. And after that, Jason posted just a few more random videos, but it wasn't until January 19, 2010 that Jason officially uploaded his first video game related video onto YouTube. MJR loves the gaming community. Like, he really loves the community. He loves it so much that he has made it a regular thing on his show to have a ton of different guests upon his show all the time. A couple games that I would love to get over here. The first one is the sequel to Death Smiles. Now we got the original here. And with that said, something that Metal Jesus Rocks does that not many others do, and that is sitting at around 530,000 subscribers. Jason Lindsay has not lost his sense of community at all. So many YouTubers that once they go big, they lose what got them there in the first place, and that is a sense of community and one with video gamers and Jason Metal Jesus has not lost that sense at all congratulations on that Jason has also done something I find really hard to do as well and that is to grow your YouTube channel immensely while keeping your main focus on retro games yes I'm aware that other channels have done it as well but it is not easy to do mostly nowadays getting big on YouTube is a lot easier to do with focusing on newer games so I just wanted to say another congratulations and well well done to MJR to keeping his focus mainly on retro and still growing so substantially. I would love to say exactly what Jason focuses on in the retro world, but I really can't. He focuses and touches on everything. He has hundreds of videos ranging from obscure gaming items to hidden gem videos to buying guides, PC games, vinyl, and even just silly randomness. My personal favorite series from the Metal Jesus Rock Show has to be his Hidden Gems Games series. As gamers, as a lifelong dedicated gamer, we can find ourselves getting into games and enjoying games and kind of feel like we've exhausted all our options as what there is to play out there, but I see Metal Jesus scavenging the depths of the gaming world to find us games that not a lot of us know about and that we can get into and are kind of the hidden games in the gem world. Again, Metal Jesus, thank you for your hidden gem series. If you're new to his channel and you check out his channel, go to his hidden gems. I promise you'll enjoy them. Play and collect Pokemon Typing DS. I, I thought you were going to say the Japanese words. No. <laughs> <laughs> that was a test. Ah, uh, sorry. <laughs> I can confidently say this and mean this. I have not only met Jason a number of times, but I have hung out with him personally on a very personal level. Go to lunch with him, go to dinner with him, have long talks with him about important things that matter. And let me say this, Jason is one of those YouTubers out there that when you meet him in person, you walk away and go, my gosh, this is one of the most genuine guys I know. So if you want to support a good YouTuber, but also a person who is simply a good dude who loves gaming and cares about people, please do yourself a big favor and support Metal Jesus Rocks. That's it for today's episode of ReviewTube. If you have watched Metal Jesus before, let me know down in the comments below. If you have not, go enjoy his channel. Who is a channel that you guys think I should talk about? Now remember, this isn't to spread the news about small YouTubers because my channel itself is small as well, but this is to simply point out love where love is due. Who do you guys think deserves some love from a silly little weirdo like me? All right, you guys, thank you for watching Superhero Game Squad. I hope you have a fantastic day. We'll see you guys make sure and subscribe we're here four to five days a week and we live stream two days a week as well all right audio see ya have a good one